a giant comet twice the size of Mount Everest is heading towards our Earth, and here's how you can observe it. A giant comet was spotted by the Hubble telescope about five years ago. At the time it was moving towards the Sun from between Saturn and Uranus. It's getting closer to Earth now, and in a few weeks it will pass close to Earth. On July 14, Comet C217K2 will be the closest to our Earth, but it will still be farther away than the distance between Earth and Mars on average. You can also see this comet through a small telescope. If the sky is clear, you might even be able to see it with your own eyes. Eddie Irizari and Kelly Kayser, Witt, NASA Solar System Ambassadors, wrote in Earth Sky that it's still not clear how big the comet's nucleus is. Different observations suggest sizes between 11 and 100 miles. That's 18 to 161 kilometers. So uh, it's big anyway, obviously. This means that C217 is one of the biggest comets that scientists have ever found. The comma, or the tail of the comet, is uh, also very big and hard to see. Based on what we know so far, the dust and gases left behind by this comet could be anywhere from 81,000 to 500,000 miles long. So this trail is somewhere between the width of one Jupiter and six Jupiters. This is truly epic. It's a huge comet. You can go to public online observatories like Virtual Telescope Project, which are sure to have witch parties at some point, watch parties at some point, to see the comet for yourself. You can even get a telescope and start learning how to look at things now with an app like Stellarium. As the comet gets closer, the app will help you point the telescope in the right direction. After C217K2 goes by us in July, it will keep going towards perihelion, towards the sun that is, the closest point to the sun before going back into deep space. As the comet gets closer to the sun, it does strange things. It could become more active and brighter all of a sudden or could break off and disappear. Any way you look at it, this will be the only chance to see this comet, and uh, it has such a long orbit that it won't come back for a few million years, according to what the astronomers are telling us. And this is our news tent. Joe, please leave your comments. Thank you for your support. Kindly support my Patreon account. The daily posts are five videos daily, and they are totally different from what I have on my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for your support and that you find all my content so interesting. You'll find the Patreon account details in the description box below.